Hi guys, welcome to DWC Academy where we show you how to design with Canva. My name is Onoha UI and in today's tutorial I'm going to be showing you how you can color grade your photos in Canva. Without any further ado, let's get started. So now that we've opened up Canva, what we're going to do is go to create a design and we're going to choose the presentation. Now we are in the editor, we're going to go over to photos and I'm going to search for this photo here, drag it to our artboard. Looking at this photo, it looks good already, but what's going to happen if we make it pop a little bit? To get started, I click on the photo, go to edit image and I'm going to choose background removal. So everything looks good, it's time to start editing. Before we do that, I'm going to make a duplicate of this. So we're going to be working on this. For this one, go over to edit image and here you're going to select adjust. Here you can add brightness, clarity, shadows and other filters that can improve your photo. We're going to set the brightness. So if you see this adjustment button, you can increase or decrease the brightness of your photo. For our reference photo, we are going to um, give it a value of 7. Now you can see that our photo is looking even brighter. The next filter we're going to add to enhance our photo is contrast. In photo editing, contrast is the difference between the light and dark part of your photo. Contrast is also used to add certain emotions or moods in a photo. Let's see how much contrast we can add to our photo. Since we want to improve the mood of our photo, we are going to give it a contrast value of say 9. Next, I will add saturation. Saturation is how much intensity I want the color in my photo to have. So for this photo, I am going to increase intensity a little bit. Let's say to value of 10. In Canva, we do not have sharpness in the edit image panel. So you can either use blur or clarity to sharpen the surface or edges of your photo. I'm going to reduce the blur value to negative 3. This will sharpen the image a little bit more. To give my photo an overall look and feel, I'm going to add some warmth filter with a value of 10. Now look at how calming this photo makes it feel right now. If you like this video, hit the subscribe button to help this channel reach more people with easy Canva design tutorials. Your support and encouragement is appreciated. To remove or reduce any halo effect, we will use the clarity filter. This will add some grainy textures which are similar to the sharpness filter in Photoshop and other design software. Let's give it a value of 4. Now our image is looking better. For our final step, we'll add some vibrance. Since we want our photo to look more natural, we will increase the intensity of some of the muted colors while leaving the saturated colors as they are. The entire idea is to intensify parts of the photos that are not colorful. Now let's fix the design to see the difference. Here is our photo before and after editing. I'm sure you can spot the difference. Now it's your turn. Take a photo of your pet, upload it into Canva, color grade it using this same method, Post it on social media and tag at Design with Canva. I will give a random shout out in the next video. Until then, bye.